welcome back to Freaky Deaky Mind. I'm Belinda. Um, first off, thank you. Thank you for coming back. Thank you for being here. I really appreciate it. Um, I have, uh, I don't know what you call this. I've watched so many videos. Anyway, I bought some things from Temu. T-E-M-U. First time I have done that. And I figured I would open this up with you guys and share some of those things. Um, so yeah, so let's get us started. It's all wrapped up in a bag. And I've noticed orders that I've seen online too, like they're all wrapped up in this. Like they don't put it in a box, it's just wrapped up in a bag. And at first when I seen Team U, my partner Trevor, he thought that it was, knew it was like, just like AliExpress, but figured it was like, um, hi Lelou, um, AliExpress kind of warehouse located in Canada, but it's not, because if you look, it's still coming from China, um, so is it just AliExpress with a different name, just to, you know what I mean, um, just to uh, make things seem like it's a different store, but it's the same stuff. I don't know, I should compare some of the products and uh, and see, you know, see if the products are, if it's the same products and what the price differences are and stuff, because I haven't, but. Let's see what I got. What in the world did I order? And one thing I've noticed too about Team U, oh my gosh. If you put some stuff in your shopping cart, they harass you. They harass you. They send you messages. They send you emails. Um, this is going out. This is gonna be gone soon. You're gonna lose this deal. Here's, you know, so much off. Here's so much off. This is for Father's Day, this and that. And it's like, if you do get on there, it's, you could be spending and buying all kinds of stuff. We'll put it that way. Definitely can buy all kinds of stuff. I think I'm going to fix this camera. So just hold on a minute. Somewhat. Now I'm kind of angled. Push over here. Oh my goodness. Anyway, let me get the glasses on and let's see what we got. First off, oh yes, I ordered this travel bag. Well, that's what I thought it was anyway. Let's see. Oh, it comes in a big zip bag. I like that. Oh. Well, first off, the zipper seem to be messed up here. A little pocket here. But I got this for more like a travel purse of some sort. Um, little pocket on this side. Let's see now when I open this up. It's going to be like... Oh yeah, pretty cool. Like it. And the bottom part on zippers for um for shoes and stuff, I guess. So I'm thinking I like this. Yeah. I could go with this. And black is a color I like. I guess you have things in it, it, it really has to like work its way out, I guess. Okay, nice big bag. So, and what did I get here? Oh yes, these things are crushed up in here. But this is, um, this is for my phone. I do have one that's more suction cup, like on your dash for, for when you drive, because I really need that. But this one's supposed to be 
a clamp. Yeah. Because the suction cups let go sometimes, but hopefully this will be good. I mean, you can tell it's cheap material, but if it does the job, you know, that's all I care about. Oh, yes, I ordered this. And oh my gosh. <laughs> One pair puts everything into clear focus. So supposedly, I didn't read the instructions. Well, that doesn't surprise me because that's kind of the way I roll lots of times. Power from 0.5 to 2.50. So I didn't read the instructions. I'm just going to try them out. Probably not going to be very good for me. Oh, they're sturdy. They're good. They're surprisingly good. They're surprisingly good. Like these ones here are blurry with a way distance. Yeah, we'll see. I mean, maybe these will just going to be blurry. Because if I take these off and I'll put these old ones on. Yeah, these are good for bringing things, which is higher, more like 325, bringing things up closer for reading and stuff. This is good for a combination of both, really, but not as good for this part. Yeah, that's good. I will keep these ones on for a while. See how that goes. Put my garbage over here. What else do we got? What is this? Oh, I know what this is. This is... I bought this soap thing. I'm just guessing this is the way it goes together. You know how you get a cake of soap? And you... It gets all funny? Supposedly... You suction cup that to your sink and you put your soap in here and then the excess will drain into your sink. But this is cheap as fuck. I don't know if that's going to work. So, so far, I'm not that excited with this team you stuff. So, I got this for the puppies. I guess you can use it for people too. You put soap in here. And I figure it would be good to brush the puppies because the soap would still come out. I don't know what this handle's for. So I got that. You do do do. Oh yes, I ordered stickers. I ordered a bunch of stickers. Oh, it's a bunch of like, um, I got a bunch of like, um, spring stickers. Sunflowers, sunflowers, I love sunflowers, with freedom flowers. With freedom, flowers, books, and the moon, who could not be perfectly happy, Oscar Wilde. So yeah, I got a bunch of stickers. I like stickers. So that was good, nice little package for them. I have to put those in a, in a place, because this little bag that it came in is not the greatest. I set that over there. Okay, so let's see how this is. I'm a bigger woman, as you can tell. I don't want to be a bigger woman forever because, you know, it's not good for me. So I ordered um, like a comfortable pajama thing for the summer. Material's not too bad. Uh, 
Well, it should fit me. Material's not too bad. Not too bad, not too bad. I love to be in summer um, attire. Not summer attire, pajama attire, pajamas. Me mama wants to wear pajamas all the time. I'm going to tuck these inside here. And I'm even going to put my stickers in here and then in a little inside pocket. pacifiers or soothers for my reborn babies. I want to see what these would be like. I think I've got four. Oh, these are cute. These are they're like little kitties. They're like little kitties. Interesting. That's kitty. And what's this one? I don't know what's that, a duck? I'm not really sure. And then this one. Oh, it's the same sort of thing, one of each. A little cat and a little ducky or something. Interesting, interesting. Next, yes, I bought a little outfit for my baby doll, one of them, let to see if this is going to fit. It's somewhat cute, there's a little pajama bottoms, I think I bought this for Lazy Daisy if I remember correctly. That's what I bought it for, and I believe this will fit her perfectly. Um, not bad. Not bad. Only paid a couple bucks for it. And I got um, a toothbrush, and I'm hoping it's super soft, for hair, baby hair. Open this up and see. Oh yeah, that's really cute. Really soft, perfect for combing hair on a new on a reborn. Put that in there, Yahoo, Yahoo. Oh yeah, <laughs> I got these uh, for a gift basically. Um. I don't know if my mom would like them or not, but actually you're supposed to stick it on your baseboard. Like in a, it's a cute little mouse thing. You stick it on your baseboard or down low. No, <laughs> that's cute. Oh yeah. And I got another one that's more like, a... let me see. Yeah, so it looks like there's a hole and a mouse hole in your house. And then I got a bunch of mental health um, stickers to which I love, love, love. Let's see. Oh yeah, I like these quite a bit. Whoop. No one will ever know the violence it took to become this gentle. Oh, that's cool. Don't overthink it. I have a pin like that. Um, mental health matters. Discussing your mental health is not attention seeking. Sorry, I told you about my mental illness. Do you still think I am hot? Well, it's kind of a weird one. Uh, this is a weird one. <laughs> okay. 
Um, you can do hard things, mental health matters, stop the stigma and the stigma. So they're different. Be kind to your mind. The sun will rise and we will try again. Mental health awareness. Um, interesting. I don't know what to think of that one really. Um, yeah, so. Oh, that's nice when you make me happy when skies are gray. I like that. So. What's this say? I don't think I can read it, see? I go like this. Social media is bad for your mental health. Social media is bad for your mental health. Damn. I'm going to have to get off this. Sorry, guys. The sticker told me I got to leave. That's it. That's it. The sticker's right. The sticker must be right. <laughs> That's weird. So some of them I think I'll use. Some of them, well, probably not. Well, this is giving me a perspective on this team use stuff. Just to see, you know, what things I like. So I got another pajama get up. Um, shorts, Elite pajama shorts, it should fit me, I hope, and a top to go with it. Well, that's a nice lounge wear. I think I would like that lounge wear. I'm really in desperate need for some clothing, like seriously. This weight gain, like I've gained so much weight. Um, I, my weight's fluctuated so much, but I would say, um, definitely it has a lot to do with mood and stuff for weight. One second. And, uh, I really... You know, over the years, I used to keep things, you know, that were smaller for me and stuff. And, oh, I'll wear them someday. And I remember I had this. <laughs> um, I had this really nice kind of dress that I bought when I lived in Calgary. And I was young. I was in my 20s. And I bought this dress a nice slit up the side and everything. And um, it didn't fit me at the time. But I thought, oh, I'm going to fit into that and I kept that for years and years and years well I kept it for at least <laughs> probably 15 years isn't that crazy 15 years and the tags were still on it and everything is brand new that's crazy when I think about it so I'm going to put this box here, and I have a couple more things, and there's a big old bag. I think that's it. Is it? It's weird how they throw everything in there. It's really weird. Like, everything is, I mean, it's cheap for them for shipping and stuff, because shipping is crazy, but, oh, I forgot I got this. So my son's hair is a growing and I got these for his hair for his man bun. But oh gosh, might be good for me too. Let's see. I'm really debating on getting this haircut again. And I go through phases like that. Because I know my hair is really thin. And it looks better when it's short. Like the hair looks better. But I just don't like how my face looks. I look fatter. And my chin side looks fatter. And I just... I don't know, I find when my hair's kind of longer, it kind of helps with that, but I don't know. I'm debating to get it, to getting cut short because it's thin. And not only that is I'm aging, it's getting thinner. And when I have it out, it's scraggly looking. At one time, you know, I could have my hair out and it wasn't too bad. But uh, 
it's still, I think the best my hair was in regards to fullness and stuff like that would have been when I was pregnant and breastfeeding with my kids. That's the best, but I don't know. What do you guys think? Think I should cut my hair? Got any ideas? Put some pictures in the comments or links to your nice pictures in the comments. That'd be great. Um, I was thinking about a pixie cut or something. It'd be super easy, super cool, but I don't know. It's just that whole thing of, of walking longer hair and, uh, but it just doesn't look good on me. It's so thin. Anyway, I got myself a clog drain that you, you know, fix the clogs and the hairs in your drain. Got that. I'm putting everything in this bag. <laughs> Now this here is another little bag I got for travel. Um, and I find like to have a little like bag pouch that goes around or something like that when you're traveling because you really don't want to be carrying a lot of stuff say if you're out exploring like, uh, excuse me, an area or something. But uh, I think this is supposed to be a man's but yeah, you can put something in there. Is that all? That one pocket? Oh, and you have a little pocket here. I find the zippers in both bags look like they're no good. Um, you know how your zipper splits in the center? I find that. So this is a bag, I guess, but it's nothing to write home about, folks. Nothing to write home about. I don't know what I paid for it, but hopefully not too much. And last but not least, I got this for a gift. Um, let's see what it is. And I'm gonna go on AliExpress because I bet I can get this exact same thing at AliExpress. But the way Team U works that I've noticed is they have a higher price and then they send you things that say, oh, this is a lower price now. Like, get it for this price. Get it for 55% off, 60% off for this day only. And there's a little countdown and all this. And they did that because really the price of this, I think was $17 or something, but I never paid $17. But when I look at it and the pictures that I seen on online on their site they made it or it appeared a lot bigger than what it was so that is disappointing um, I think I'm just a negative person because I've seen other people do team U hauls and they're all seem to be super positive maybe I was a negative person I don't know but let's see. This is cute. It's super cute. It's a little plant pot. Um, like a little grandma face, a little plant pot. I thought it was a lot bigger. I got this for my mom. That's what I was thinking of because she likes little plants and stuff. I don't really know. It would have to be a fake plant you'd have to stick in there. I guess you could put a real one, but it would have to be one that wouldn't grow fast, like a cactus or something. It's super tiny, but in the pictures, it looked like it was a big thing because they had it sitting outside. You know, in comparison of the scale and everything of things that are around it, you're thinking this thing is fairly big, but it's super small. That's still cute. All right, that's my Team U haul or opening or whatever. Um... And that was good. I was excited waiting for this today just to see what it was like. And um, yeah, I, I, uh, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed opening it up. This is my favorite, I would say. <laughs> oh, it is cute. It's a cutie. Um, however, put it back here. You guys can see it. Well, maybe it'll tip over. I better not do that. Um, however, I can't see me doing too many of these orders. Um, I might be a negative person, maybe. I do not know, but I cannot. Um, 
I'll probably try a baby on Team U because I know other people have got babies there and stuff. Um, but I think I am going to explore the difference between Team U and AliExpress and just look and see because I really do think it's pretty much the same place. Just they put a different website up to, to market more because AliExpress has probably, you know, that China kind of thing hanging over it and this here made it appear like it was coming from a location in Canada so and it's not you know because it says Canada Post blah 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 and you're thinking okay this is coming from Canada area but then when you get the tracking number and all that it's obvious it's not coming from Canada it does take a while mine did mine took a while weeks actually I, I'd have to look but probably good three three to four weeks for this order to come. Um, but that's that. So everybody have a great day. Um, don't forget today is the first day of the rest of your life. What are you going to do about it? And um, smile. You know, smile is contagious. It can go a long way. All right, guys. Bye.